What's good guys, I'm Zavievic here again, and welcome your faces back to another episode of Cube World Season 6. We are on episode 22, in case you didn't read the title. And we're back today, sadly, sadly in this ocean. I gotta say, I gotta be honest guys, sadly we're back in the ocean, and I'm thinking we're gonna go maybe island to island, exploring, uh, Tommy, dude, get down here man. Okay, there we go. Uh, maybe explore island to island and get to the village. Um, I don't know. Maybe just go along the coastline till we find a new biome. I'm not sure. We'll play it by ear and see how things go. But I want to say thank you guys for supporting the series. I love you guys for it. And as my final days consistently on YouTube are coming to an end, uh, I want to make sure I'm bringing the best videos out for you guys. And trust me, um, for those of you guys who have been around for a little bit, Oh, hello, something died with a bunch of stuff I don't want. I do want these leftovers, though. Oh, it made me pick up the radish slice. That's, that's, that's got to go. Man, that's, that's got to go. But, for those of you who have followed the channel for a while, you guys know that me and my brother started and almost finished a series of Outlast. We played it together, and we kind of switched off, switched off controllers uh, and just kind of enjoyed the game. Actually, let's, let's grab you guys, and let's kill you. Um... So, we're going to try to finish that before I leave. That would be cool. That's kind of the goal, um, is to finish it before I have to head out to college, which would be cool. Um, don't know if it's 100% going to happen, but we're going to try. And so that's, you know, that's going to replace Cube World one or two days. Maybe we'll just... Okay, yeah, someone did tell me about that. Is that you can't hit an enemy that's what what happened with the uh hell demon in the lava lands that we found if you guys watch that part is that we couldn't hit him well that's a gigantic mawfish i think that's a boss we couldn't hit him it kept missing because we were shooting him from a place that he couldn't hit us um and i think that's what just happened there as well um we're gonna chill up here and kill this shark now can we fight this guy this has to be a boss Mawfish aren't that big, are they? No. No, this is definitely a boss. It's moving all slow. Yeah, this is 100% a boss. we got to be careful, though. There's some piranhas over there. Those guys are bad news. Sharks we can de deal with. Seymour. <laughs> Seymour the Mawfish. <laughs> Your name is officially Seymour Butts, my sir. I hope you enjoy it. He's doing something. Oh, he's doing a little mage attack. He's doing the he's doing the mage attack. I wish we could get a better uh, better view of him. There we go. And if he's locked on Tommy, we are good because we're just gonna float here and attack him from a distance, which is awesome. See more of the mawfish. You got you are going down, my good sir. Hey, you stop that. There we go. Look at all that damage, guys. That's crazy. Um, and I've been thinking a lot about Destiny 2. I, I was watching some gameplay, playing the beta for you guys. We should have one more video coming out. Uh, on the beta, which is showcasing the farm, and it's all of its cool stuff. Um, but I was thinking about that, and that led me to today's question. And I'm curious, you know, you guys may be excited for Destiny 2, but what games are coming out, you know, soon that you guys are really excited for? Um, for me, it's definitely Destiny 2, obviously. Um, it's Destiny 2, it's Super Mario Odyssey for sure. Um, I'm actually really excited to play um, Mario plus Rabbids Kingdom. Maybe I already asked you guys this. I think I already did. Like, now that I like remember what I'm saying, I'm pretty sure I already asked you guys this. Okay, well, let's think of a different question that's video game related because this is a gaming channel. Um, oh, here we go. So what games do you want to come out that haven't been announced yet, maybe? Or that, you know, are in development? We just killed him. 118 XP. Let's go. Fire Spirit, Iron Mace. That's so lame, but that's okay. What games are you guys excited for that you want to come out that have a potential of coming out but aren't confirmed? What games do you guys want to come out? For me, dude, I don't even know. I really want Skyward Sword to be remastered. I know that's kind of dumb, but it was my, my first Zelda game as a kid. And it's my favorite Zelda game. I think that would be cool. Um, Sapphire Fish, like, I would kill him. He's probably only going to give me one XP. And Sapphire Fish are freaking awesome, man. They're so cool looking. I wish so bad that you could tame them. 
Just look at him. Oh, man, so cool looking. Um, but, yes. Ooh, there's ruins on this island. Hello, I see you. I see you. No quest, though. That's kind of lame, to be honest. Got some wolves here that we can kill. Um, but, yeah, Zelda Skyward Sword HD or a remake, graphical remake of some kind with that. Dude, that... Okay, that wolf's just going to stay up there forever, then. Um, what games do I want to come out other than that? Um... Man, I think Super Mario Galaxy 3 would be really cool. Uh, they're not going to come out with it, though, because of Super Mario Odyssey. I wish. Uh, but they're not going to. Super Mario Odyssey is probably just going to be uh, just as good. So, uh, But Super Mario Galaxy is another game that I grew up with as well. Um, hmm. Let's think. Other games that I really want to come out that aren't confirmed. A lot of people wanted, like, Metroid. Prime. Ooh, they're plus ones here. Oh, hello. They're orange. I didn't think to check this place. Are they all beating up on Tommy right now? Oh, my gosh. Dude, they're not even doing damage to him. They're not even doing damage. Tommy is going in. He is going in. Well, they are. I should say they are doing damage, but not much. Okay, we can totally... I don't know about this dungeon. It's red. The boss is really the only thing that we want. And if the boss is super hard, I don't think we stand a chance, guys. Because if these guys are orange, an orange boss is is probably not going to do us too well. Hey, but those guys certainly did. Let's get the level up. Um, I mean, we got to go with swimming, right? If we're trying to make it to the towns, we can get on a freaking boat. Let's put them in the swimming. I don't care. We're going full YOLO mode here. Yeah, we're going to just pass through these ruins. Man, we're going to pass through them. Because we don't stand a chance against a red level dungeon boss. I'm telling you guys that right now. Even if we do, we don't have the potions for it. And it's going to take us about five years. Approximately five years. That's a uh, calculated estimate of how long it will take us to kill. So we're not going to do that. Hey. Hey, you stop that, zombie. Okay, zombie zombie, and, and some beetle and some tacos. Yeah, we'll take this XP. If we can survive it... Oh, I would freaking dang it, man. It's just about to heal up. All right. Those guys are probably still there, though. Well, no, those are skull bowls. I don't know what part of the island I was at. That's okay. There are a lot, surprisingly. You'll be surprised at how many skull bowls there are in oceans. Like, I'm being serious, guys. There are so many. Um, and I really wish that I had more Destiny 2 beta gameplay to bring for you guys. Or just Destiny 2 gameplay in general. But uh, I don't. I recorded, you know, what I could, and it was, like, when the Division beta came out, I don't know what, like, what that was. Dude, I totally realized we just forgot to go to that underwater cave. Dang it. Um, but when the Division beta came out, if you guys remember that series, I had, like, like 20 episodes plus a live stream on that game, or 20, yeah, 20 episodes plus a live stream of the Division beta. And I guess, you know, that was a sign of things to come when, when I have a 156 episode series of the game um but i don't know like that was in like i think that was over winter break if i'm gonna be honest because the game came out in march no maybe it, hmm, i don't know because if it was during school then like everything other than school that i did would have been the division beta because I, I remember spending hours just recording and playing it how does it how this bat is surviving in this underwater cave i don't know this underwater cave is so cool, though. Holy crap, man. Look at him, dude. He's flying all slow-mo. You stop it. Good, sir. There we go. Got it. Okay. Uh, Did that... That I feel like that blew up something. Did it? I don't know. Maybe this is just the end of a cave. This camera angle is horrendous. Or maybe it's just because the bomb is underwater, Jacob. My goodness. I don't think it works underwater. That sucks. There was another cave entrance over here, though, is what it looked like. So this is probably the other half of that cave. So, yeah, has to be. And there's nothing here anyway, so that's cool. But underwater caves are sick, man. They're sick. Uh, but, yeah, this time with the with the beta for Destiny 2, um, just didn't find, like, a crap ton of time, you know? I just... It was just... You know, I casually recording, I do have work eight hours a day, um, and from what time I don't devote to work, I like to spend with family, and uh, I've been hanging out, out a lot with my friends, 
uh, the past, you know, week ish, uh, just because I want to get some, some time to hang out with them before college and stuff. Um, so, you know, not as much time, but I think the game, what the gameplay that I did get was really good. Uh, I, I loved it, man. And, uh, hopefully I can record some more when the actual game comes out. That, that would be super cool. Um, uh, cause I freaking, man, I am so excited. Uh, once I get paid from actually, uh, yeah, once I get paid at the end of the month for my job, uh, I am going to pre-order Destiny 2 and uh, and get all that good stuff. I know I could have pre-ordered it for the beta, but I figured if there was an open beta anyway, I would be I would be able to. So I, luckily I was. Um, but you guys can see what I'm talking about. The canyons and everything that is so cool in Cube World's Oceans. And we're going for these caves because caves are sweet. Hello, Mr. Seahorse. I feel like you can tame these with mods or something. Um... I want to say you can't, but I, I don't think I don't think you can. I I think that would be a perfect tameable pet in this game, uh, but you can't. So that's kind of kind of lame, um, dude. These caves have got to give me more than just this, man. I know there's there's something behind that wall, but you can't bomb it because it's underwater. There could be diamonds back there for all I know, which sucks. And I'm never gonna find diamonds. What is all this? It look, this stuff looked like uh, like pickupable items. Retrievable items. I don't even know what I'm talking about. That's okay, guys. That's okay. My face might be a little bit blue in this face cam, guys. I tried. I'm still a noob with webcams. I, I did fix some some lighting and stuff to make it overall a little more uniform between episodes, but still, I still kind of suck. Um, so that's you know, it's fine. What is that thing? Is this? Oh, that's a seagull, isn't it? Ah. I don't think I... Wait, do we have a salted caramel? No. Dang it, man. Seagulls are rare, man. They're cool. I, I personally... Seagulls are one of the coolest... One of the cooler pets in the game. In my opinion. Not anywhere near turtles or anything like that. This has to be the island with the village on it. Yeah, it is. Okay, cool. I was going to say, man, like... That is one big island. Alright. And... You know... We'll go. We'll see what they have. There's another cave over there. I feel like we might have been to that one already. We're just going to swim to this island. See what it has to offer. I wish, like, as a mage, I wish, you, like, you have the teleport ability. I wish you could, like, teleport to a portal you've been to without being in another portal. But maybe Cube World Magic doesn't work like that. But I think it, I think it should. I think that would be super cool. And this ocean, I, like I said, ocean terrain is awesome. I would, I feel like a really cool biome would be like a dried up ocean like that was dried up and like there were, there were towns and dungeons that had sprouted up because you know because it had been dead for such a long like a sand sea like in Zelda Skyward Sword I could talk about that game forever but I think that would be cool also the HD remake if that ever comes to switch would be so awesome I think that'd be so cool all right let's get some silver I feel like we haven't mined any silver in a really long time Wow, me and Tommy four shot that bat. Ooh, these houses are cool. They're kind of oceanic. Kind of got that coastal feel with the white and brown, a little bit of navy blue on top. Or is that black? I think that's black, actually. Well, still still slightly oceanic. I don't know why I'm getting him water. Or full. Garak City, huh? Okay, there is a quest out here in the ocean that we're fairly close to that I kind of want to take on. But first things first. Town Ahoy. Let's get over here. I don't know if we can make anything new. We could customize some stuff. This we can make um we can make some wood cubes, I think. Yeah. Let's do it. From all this wood that we've had sitting in our inventory the entire game so far. Yeah. Let's let's get it. Lots of fortune on these. That's good. Um okay, and I don't know if we can can we what does the workbench do? Can I craft something? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Wood staff was 42. Actually, that's pretty good. Not gonna lie, that's that's uh, that's pretty good. Actually, we're gonna. That's the formula. Wait, it says I have one. Hang on. I might have just almost just wasted a bunch of materials. No, we do have this. Yeah, if we've got this, I'm going to use that. Okay, guys, our first staff ever used in this game. It looks sweet. Um, if we can find the blacksmith, we can we can actually customize it. That would be cool. Um, yeah, because we haven't really customized anything. We can add wood cubes to it and make it look sick. 
which is something we haven't done. I haven't really showcased. Um, I haven't really showcased the the customization in this, so we can add a spirit to it as well. So I say let's start adding some wood on the tops of this. Do we? Hmm. That looks pretty cool as it is. Maybe we add some some stuff like that. I don't want to add any more to the top because I feel like it would clutter it up too much. Oh, I messed up. Can I take it off? No, but I can move it somewhere else. It always that astounds me that you can do that. I don't know why, but like I always like think of it as something else. And I guess we'll just pop this ice well, that's not where I wanted to put it. <laughs> we'll pop this ice spirit on the very top there. That's a pretty cool looking staff. Check that out, guys. That looks sick. That looks sick. Okay. Um, potion shop ahoy. Let's check it out. You should have the legendary lamp, man, so we can cross it off the bucket list before I really have to take a break from the game for a while. Just do it, man. That's all I ask. And we can check the armor shops and everything, too. I do plan on doing that. This town is kind of laggy. I don't know why. It's an ocean. There's, like, nothing to render. No, nothing. Nothing new. We still have full glass flask. Hello, wall. Wow. Okay. Uh, this is the armor shop. Let's check it out. Come here, dude. Okay, let's check out plus 42. Getting there. Oh, plus 43. Dang it, man. Silk shoulder armor. This might be better. Nope, dude. That <laughs> those the stuff we have is pretty pretty good. Um those are even not better. So, I mean, we can look at weapons. I kind of don't want to get any weapons though because I've just made one kind of but we can see, ooh, we can see, oh, hey, check this guy out. This is something we haven't seen in the series yet. He has that above his head, and he'll ask, have you already explored Ikogar Island? If we scroll out in the map, it will tell us and give us a little location of where Ikogar Island is. And those guys are kind of all over the place. They're kind of, um, boy, I took a weird path going to this city. Um... Those uh, are just, they appear and, oh, see, check it out. Look at this. So the Rock of Terralon, that sounds sick. Because that's a, um, that's a death plateau out in the middle of the ocean. That sounds awesome. I wish we could go over there and explore it. Maybe someday. Maybe someday. But for now, I've drawn a crowd with my, my speeches about quests. But yeah, those are little things. They don't give you the quest for it, but they tell you the location. So you can either come back later or when it does have a quest, you know exactly what the quest is, uh, what you can do with it. So that's cool. I like that. I think that's a... Oh, hello. Narno Palace. Whoa. Dude, they're attacking the townspeople. You're, atta you're attacking the townspeople! I heard someone die. I heard someone die. Oh, the swirling vortex of death. Dude, I freaking saved you. Do I know you? That kind of seems like something that someone would say after their life being saved. Do I know you? Wow, dude, I've never seen that happen before. I, fi I always figured it could happen because I've seen, like, wandering bands of rogue adventurers uh, in the outskirts of town or even, you know, walking through town a little bit, but I've never seen them actually kill someone before that's crazy man we live in a crazy cube world and wow we are out of time for this episode i didn't realize how much time had passed but we're gonna head on to this quest for next time i'm not hating our time in the ocean guys i'm gonna be honest it's it's been fairly fun with the with the underwater caves and the town was cool um so yeah we're, we're just chilling just chilling in the ocean kind of working our way through we're gonna leave as soon as we can um, but yeah, that's gonna do it for us today. Thank you everyone so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to slap a like on it for me or subscribe if you haven't already. And as always, I'm Zombie Gaming MC, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace! Yeah.